Hi, today I'm going to talk about Metal Organic Frameworks or MOFs. My name is Masood. I'm a researcher in nanotechnology and nanoscience. What is a MOF? Metal organic frameworks are organic inorganic hybrid crystal in porous materials that consist of a regular array of positively charged metal ions surrounded by organic linker molecules. The metal ions form knots that bind the arms of the linkers together to form a repeating cage-like structure. Due to this hollow structure, metal organic frameworks have an extraordinarily large internal surface area. MOFs offer unique structural diversity in contrast to other porous materials. Uniform porous structures, atomic level structural uniformity, tunable porosity, extensive varieties and flexibility in network topology, geometry, dimension and chemical functionality. This allows researchers the successful control of framework topology, porosity, and functionality. The physical chemical properties of materials are governed by the synergistic effects of a structure and compositions and MOFs are fascinating examples of how the unique structure of hollow structured materials can provide a whole raft of advantages features. Among them are enhanced surface to volume ratio, low density, micro reactor environment, higher loading capacities and reduced transmission lengths of mass and charge. Consequently, the preparation of hollow structures for technological applications has long been a popular research field for chemists and material scientists. However, the synthesis of porous or hollow structure materials with controllable and especially complex structures and certain composition in a controlled manner has always been a challenge for scientists. Inter-MOFs, crystalline hybrid materials created from both organic and inorganic molecules via molecular self-assembly, pioneered in the late 1990s, design and synthesis of an exceptionally stable and highly porous metal organic framework by Professor Omar Yagi at UC Berkeley, MOFs have become a rapidly growing research field. So far, more than 20,000 different MOFs have been fabricated and characterized. What are MOF applications? Numerous applications in many fields are being developed that exploit MOF's cage-like structure such as gas storage and separation, liquid separation and purification, electrochemical energy storage, catalysis and sensing. In addition to direct applications, MOFs have been used as unique precursors for the construction of inorganic functional materials with unparalleled design possibilities such as carbons, metal-based compounds, and their composites. Currently, carbonaceous materials are attracting much interest 
for their extensive applications including adsorption, catalysis, batteries, fuel cells, supercapacitors, and drug delivery and imaging. In addition, some sensors are also one of the important applications of carbonaceous materials because they are closely related to human health. There are varieties of approaches for the preparation of these carbon materials, but among them directly carbonizing from organic precursors is the most frequently used method to prepare nanoporous carbons due to its flexibility and simplicity. These materials present certain drawbacks though such as low surface areas, disordered structures, and non-uniform sizes which will greatly limit their applications. However, researchers found that carbon materials derived from metal organic frameworks could overcome these limitations. Okay guys, thanks for watching this video. Please like and subscribe us and ask any question and anything that you want to be presented on the channel. See you. Bye bye.